Hello, I'm Dr. Robert LaBelle. Today, we're going to go through eccentric strength training for the knee. Eccentric strength training, like we've covered before, is a strengthening procedure where the muscle's elongating, and what research shows is that as the tissue elongates and you're putting it under strain, the tissue will slowly rebuild over time. Most sports medicine research talks about a 12-week program of doing this exercise daily or in the minimum three times a week. So we're going to demonstrate it with Ariana. Grab the ball, Ariana. I'm going to go against the wall. Any type of ball could be used for this. You could be using a physio ball such as this or even a soccer or basketball. Really the ball is aimed at providing some degree of fluid movement through the exercise. Ariane is going to do what some people call a drop squat. Very simply, her weight is going to drop out just like that and then she comes up. To begin with though, what would be like to be noticed is that her knees aren't locked out. We never have the knees locked out in this exercise. There's always a bit of a bend in them. The key to this exercise is that when Ariana drops out, she catches herself. And when she catches herself, it causes a, a bit of a strain to that knee tendon down here. So you'll feel a little bit of pull or a mild amount of discomfort. If you're feeling a lot, discontinue the exercise and we'll discuss it. So let's have you drop out. We'll have you do a couple. And she catches herself and then slowly goes back up. What she's doing when she drops out, drop out for me, stop there. She's at about a 90 degree here. We don't want to go much further than that and then come back up. Like I said, we'll do 12 repetitions and then take a break and we'll do that three times. As time goes on, we'll start to advance the procedure and she'll put more of her weight on one leg, thus keeping her toes up for some balance and support. Drop out and then back up. And an even more advanced procedure is take that foot off the ground, drop, and back up. That's a challenging exercise. If balance is an issue, for whatever reason, it's suggested to have maybe a couple dining room chairs, something that you could at least hold on to or do it near some degree of support. Um, a little bit of discomfort following this exercise following this exercise is quite normal and the reason behind that is you're pulling on the inflamed tendon to rebuild it so icing some anti-inflammatory and resting right after this exercise is definitely warranted